All right, so you want to try to throw a rock? I would like to try very much. All right, well, let's see if we can make sure you don't fall here. <laughs> I'll try. Woo! Good start. <laughs> so your right foot goes in here. Okay. And your left foot should okay. be in underneath you. Yeah? So all your weight should be under this foot here. Okay. So like this. Okay. When you're about to kick out, this foot goes right in underneath your body. Yeah. Right in under, so that when you slide out, that's got all your balance. Give it a quick try, just a little push. Get your rocks moving a little first. Rocky. Just get them moving, otherwise they're stuck. Ooh, and just give it a little, they're 42 pounds. 42 pounds. <laughs> and then just give a little push and stretch out your back leg. Okay. There you go, stretch oh. out the back leg, stretch it out, stretch it out. Look at that, slid to the T-line first try. That's really hard. <laughs> so explain why you sweep. Well, good question, because there's always sweeping going on and the skip's always shouting. So, when the skip is usually shouting the sweep, there's two reasons. When you sweep, you're creating less friction on the ice. You're actually technically melting the ice and creating a watery film. Now, it's not like a hair dryer on the ice, but when you do that, the rock will travel a little farther because there's less friction and it's not going to curl as much. So usually if the rock is light, meaning it's not going to get to where you want it to, you'll sweep to get more distance mm -hmm. or it's curling too much and the skip is screaming emphatically for you to sweep. You kind of hold a broom like a hockey stick and the bottom of the rock is actually only about six and a half inches wide. So there's a little ridge along here. Oh. So you only want to sweep in front of the rock. If you're doing this, you're wasting energy. So you want to get here and you kind of want to sweep as hard and as fast as you can. Pretty good, pretty. You don't want now. Don't want now, one rock. thing you just did there. This now in curling, that's called a burnt rock, uh -huh. which means you touched it. So if the rock was coming down in play and you were sweeping it and accidentally burn it, it comes out of play. When you're sweeping along, you're going to be like this, and you're going to kind of whatever feels comfortable, but just like a foot shuffle, but still remembering the sweep. Are you ready? Uh, I guess so. Yes. All right. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. All right. Start sweeping. Move. Hurry hard. Come on. Hard. Don't like touch the rock. Keep going. Keep going. Harder, Carlin. Go, 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 go. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. That was good. Well done.